Happy Monday. President's Day, I think. Something like that. I know yesterday was Valentine's Day, but um, yeah, just out and about running errands and stuff. Gotta go get myself some proteins and beans and different things like that. Nuts and seeds or whatever. Just to keep myself balanced out. Sadly, I am still on the shelf. I did hit incline press yesterday. Six sets of six reps at 225.5 pounds. So I'm finally making my jump, which should be on Wednesday to 225. Um, I'm happy about it. The gains are going up in the chest region. Um, I'm not quite ready to start doing flat bench again yet, but I'll get there. Um, back's feeling really iffy especially after last night. I thought I was feeling a little bit better, but um, it's just how things are when you have a back injury. So I'm gonna take it slow. Um, maybe I'll come back and do abs um, and back on Wednesday. If my back's feeling really funny, I'll probably just do upper back on Wednesday and uh, chest and not do any abdominal movements and just focus on trying to come back strong on uh, Thursday and hit the uh, hit legs and uh, lower back on Thursday. But you know, I, I've learned how to just deal with this. I'm not really worried about it. It, it happens from time to time. Um, like I was telling my partner, I probably needed a deload anyway, um, cause I don't take many day, or I don't take any days off and I work out four days a week and I do legs, deadlifts, especially heavy deadlifts, um, three days a week. So, you know, it, it's, just, it's just one of those things when you're lifting that often with a back injury, you're gonna sooner or later run into problems. So I'm not really, I'm not, I'm not tripping at all about it. So endomorphs, what I wanted to talk um, about today is the necessity of water intake. You really need to start breaking up your water throughout the day and getting, what is it, 985 grams of water um, four times um, throughout the day. I think that comes to a little less than 4,000 grams per day, which is a gallon of water. We need to be drinking a gallon of water. Um, fiber intake has to be through the roof because we have a slower metabolism and uh, usually um, not as regular bowel movements as other uh, body types. Why this is, I don't know the science behind it. All I can speak of is for myself, but I know that this is a common problem based on research. Even if you're having the regular bowel movements, the metabolism is still usually a lot slower on average than other body types. The way to speed that up is making sure that you get at least a gallon of water per day, at least. And then making sure that those fiber numbers are really high. Um, I would recommend getting a fiber supplement. I'm not on one, but I eat a lot of leafy greens throughout the day, so I don't tend to have the uh, the issue with getting enough fiber in. But for those, which is common, that do not like eating um, a great deal of leafy green vegetables throughout the day, I would recommend getting on a fat fiber supplement. You can find that at vitaminshop.com or you know, you can research and then find the stuff on Amazon or whatever and save yourself a lot of money. But I'm telling you right now, from experience, when I was drinking the most water, I was uh, lean in comparison to when I wasn't drinking as much water. It's a funny thing that your, your body lets go of a lot of fats and water, actually, the more water that you have in your system. It's, it, it, it's really weird. And if your goal is to um, get lean and maintain leanness, you gotta have that water in your system. You have to uh, stay hydrated, especially during your workouts. You know, and then, you know, you probably wanna taper it off as you're going to bed because you don't wanna have to be getting up in the middle of the night and using the restroom and, uh, and you know, aggravating your sleep schedule. But, you know, like I said, a, a smart way to break that water intake up is to have the 985 grams. I think it's something like that. You know, just have a thousand or whatever. Drink, drink 4,000 grams of water per day. Fresh water, not coffee, not other beverages. I know that there's, you know, people out there that say, oh, you know, everything counts. I mean, you know, that's great that everything counts, but you should want to be 
pushing fresh water through your system every day anyway. You know, fresh, filtered, I stay away from tap water, you know, clean, a clean water source, fresh water going through your system all day long. You're gonna feel great, your skin's gonna look better, you're gonna um, be urinating out all those toxins, hopefully it'll increase your bowel movement um, um, numbers throughout the week and you know let, let's 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 do whatever it takes to get ourselves burning fat and to get that uh, lean defined cut up physique that we want happy monday